Hey everyone, let's play some games. Today I'm playing the Acromel. I have four days left of the season and I still need that final win streak to get to the top 16. Let's see if I can make it happen. First opponent, Warlock. Alright, so have a Mookla. Interesting. I could coin it out, so that could be quite good. But... Hmm... I would like a one drop also. Let's see. Backstab, very nice. Oh, okay, this is a great hand. Great hand. I think a coining out Edwin. Okay, so it's a... Sue. Wow, I have so many things that I want to play on turn two. Well, I don't want to use the coin yet. Even though coin dagger would not be bad, but I need it for later. So let's play in Lebanon for now. Hmm. Well, I think making a 6-6 six, six at win when cleave is the best choice for next turn. I could also make a 4-4 four, four and then backstab as I 7 next turn. Hmm, what to do? Let's make a 6-6. Six, six. And maybe play a 5-5 five, five next turn. Hmm. Even though bananas are really good for Argent Squires, so maybe not. Let's see. For the crusade! I don't know, I wish I had a Blood Knight. So yeah, a lot of people who say, oh, you don't have Mukla or Edwin. I think the Blood Knight is a really good choice. Oh, let's see. Well, now, this Mukla is not very appealing because... You could give two bananas to the Scarlet Crusader. Hmm. What to do here? I wish I had a one drop or something because daggering up seems pretty good here. Next turn, possibly Cold Blood plus SI7 if Cleave is still alive. Oh. Play that, he just kills it with that. Here we go. Let's do this. It's too bad he got all those shielded minions out. Well I'm definitely glad I got rid of one of the shields there. Wow, I had a great start, but it seems like he's having an even better start. Okay, Argent Squire, that's definitely a good draw. Let's see how it'll do. The light protects me. <laughs> this. Here we go. Hmm. That Blood Knight is annoying. If I'm lucky, this minion will survive with the shield until next turn. Put a cold blood on it. Hopefully, finish that blood knight off. Get in there and fight, maggot. Okay, going face maybe. Yeah. What's well, a bit annoying since? Hmm. How do I want to do this? I can play Mukla. Cold Blood.
lights out. Oh, I'm not sure here. But I think I'm gonna go this way. That's very aggressive. I'm just hoping he doesn't have like a Leroy or like well Leroy power overwhelming stuff like that. But I just I could have killed that, but it just would have been so ineffective. My shield for Argus. Okay, that's all he can do this turn. Happy with that. Yeah, okay, I'm glad with what I did now. If I had a shadow step, <laughs> I would be so close to lethal. I don't know. So, let's see, what do we do? Take hey, that out. Lights out. Like that. So do I play the, that dagger, or do I play the Echo Letter Pain normal dagger? Do I kill that? I think I kill that. And then do five more damage to the face there. Yeah. And then I have possible lethal next turn. With the Leroy. 8, 14. Yeah, okay. Let's see if he can kill me. Hopefully not. No Leroy shenanigans. Excellent. See, yep. <laughs> Gotta be careful, I don't attack the whelps. Oh, that was a bit shaky, but managed to win. Happy I took the aggressive route there. I gained so few ranks and wins. Well, let's see. If I can keep it up. Guess I just need like to win six or seven times in a row when I get there. See what we get. Honda. Don't see them too much, but once in a while they show up. Deadly poison could be useful, but mm. I'm really looking for one drop here. Okay, there we go. Well, I don't have anything great to play next turn, but I do have my dagger. A loot holder would be nice, though. damage in as possible, especially since I have Leroy in my hand, so if I get a shallow step or two, I can finish this game pretty early. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Lebanon. So there's an aggro. Two of them. I think I want to play this guy. Alright, since it is an aggro hunter... Let's... let's kill it. Yeah. Going for the board control. I mean, I was tempted to keep it there since then I could kill it with the Acolyte next turn because I'm pretty sure he would have gone face with it. And you know what? That might have been better because then I would have gotten an extra card from that. I wouldn't have taken any more damage. In fact, I might have done one more damage to the face. Hmm. Well, let's see what he does. Car. 
soon he goes straight. Oh, going for the acolyte. I'm perfectly happy with that. I want to put Cold Blood on my Squire here this turn. So they play the Cold Light Oracle. I think that's okay. Then I can play the SI7 later, possibly next turn, uh, for the 2 damage. I only have I only have two minions on the board, so not overloading it too much. Okay, probably explosive trap, right? to play the Acolyte of Pain, and then triggering the explosive, I'll draw a card. Because I think I might want to be a bit more aggressive than that. Like maybe even play the Assassin's Blade. And again, that might be a good play next turn. Could play... Argent Squire, SI7, this turn. After Leroy, let's take the aggressive play rather than the value play. First, we trigger the trap. Could have been misdirection, so attacking with the two attack one first. Okay. Get some damage in it. Do have the Leroy. If you get a shadow step, then and. I might just Assassin's Blade Deadly Poison face next turn. We'll see what he does. Buzzard, Unleash, probably. Yeah. Did he use the coin yet? I don't even remember. He might be able to coin out a timber wall. Let's see. Use of Satin. Then he takes out the free free. Yeah, okay. Okay, so. Hmm. If I do that, I can do 5 damage to him this turn. Another 5 next turn. I'll get him down to 10. I have that Leroy. If only I had like an eviscerate or a shadow step. Let's see how much he has. Hmm, I think this is tough. Lebanon, Acolyte. I killed a starving faucet no matter what. Let's just go with this and, and hope I get like a shadow step on a visit or something like that. Okay. I mean, he might even be able to kill me this turn. Mm, no, actually, probably not. He 
He only has six mana after all. Come on. If it's a rate of shadow step. He knows that he could potentially die. Oh, secret. What well, cold blood? If it's explosive trap, I can win. If it's misdirection... Well, then I won't win. What if, what if I played Lipanum first? Still doesn't really. It's twelve now. It doesn't really help me. Here we go. But it doesn't hurt me. Oh, okay, here let's just trigger the trap here. This direction, okay. Not too surprising. Oh, I should have sapped. Oh. Then, if it was explosive... No, it would still have... Mm. Let's see, if I had sapped, then the misdirection... Then the misdirection would have gone on on the Leroy. Right. Okay, I don't think I could have run. He got it. Traps are tricky. Let's play another game. 64. <laughs> All right. And let's see what we get. Good. So I'll keep backstab, like because then potentially, like if he plays something like a uh, Berserker, I can do full damage to it this way. On turn three, or... ah, we'll see. I think this is a reasonable opening hand, especially if I get a one drop. Mm, not this time. I like the Acolyte versus Warriors though, because it's kind of like an insurance against Whirlwind. Nothing to do there, yeah. Alright, so I think I'm gonna kill the armor smith this turn. Yeah. Probably gonna end up playing a, an Acolyte of Pain next turn. We'll see. There's also the cold blood into Eviscerate play if he plays. Well, not that. I'll just kill that. Hmm. Kill it with my dagger. Nah, no need to. I'll play my acolyte. Kill that. Yes. Plus, I need some cards. I mean, I don't have any minions in my hand. I do have a lot of burst here, together with a Leroy, if I can get him. Maybe another Acolyte. I give Culpa to the Acolyte, not the SI7, because then it would get up to 7 attack and would be 
vulnerable to a big game hunter. And I've never really seen a warrior run silence, so. Oh. Makes sense. That's really good for him actually, because now I don't get any cards from the acolytes. That's brutal. That's really brutal. Uh, let's see. Just gonna play Assassin's Plate. Get some poison on it next turn. Wow. <laughs> that was rough. I could have kept the five free acolyte though. It would have been pretty good for me. Um, bum bum bum. Wanna do deadly? Hey, lights out. Attack like that. But I think I might want to shadow step it to kill that off, and then also play the Mukla. So how he's fourteen life could get him down to eight, but <laughs> this guy's toast. let's do that. No plan. Let's draw a, a Leroy. Okay, hmm. Suddenly things are not looking so bad, unless he can clear the board easily. Execute, I assume. Yeah. Eight, twelve. Oh. Okay, slam. Okay. Come on, lever. Oh, not making up for. Last time. Hmm. Still really close to lethal, but I do need some card that can do some damage. Just that early play against my acolytes just was really rough for me, since now I'm running out of cards because of it. win me the game. But that's not the right. So how do I handle this? Probably eviscerate that. Second to ten, get down to four life, but then he still has that. So why don't I kill that? Keep board control. He did use both of his executes and slams, and shield slam is not gonna be able to do free damage unless he has another shield block. That would actually suck. I bring hmm, like strong. Cold light oracle, not a bad draw, that's for sure. Another coal light, especially since I'll just burn cards here. Mm. Edwin, probably. The yeah, let's see that. Okay. Hey, lights out. I fight. Here we go. I was tempted to play um, the Loot Hoarder just so I could get like some more cards, but I feel like the 6-6 six, six is more important here. Okay. 
Oh, the Baron getting nasty. At least he loses his uh, Alex Strasser there. I think I just play everything and that'll help me to get like three new cards for next turn. Just uh, Lebanon will do a damage or two damage I mean. <laughs> what a weird game. I'm glad he's Alex Strasse is gone though. Also because I'm getting pretty close to being dead. Like, I mean, I would be if he Alex Strasse is on me. I still have 21 life. So he'll probably armor up, right? Get to 11, but then he loses to 2 again from Baron Gen. Plus, he loses 2 from. Ah, Shield Block. Well, I should be expect as much. I mean, he's been through almost you know, his entire deck. Setting up a lever for next turn with the uh, uh, let's see lever maybe that's not lever. Yeah, I'm pretty likely to die here, but um, let's see. Play the loot holder. Hmm. I think that's all I can do here. And just hope for a miracle. Hmm. Alright, okay, that makes sense. He wasn't just being silly. Well, thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.